Watson, um, why didn't you ever, or have you ever thought about, you're talking about Poitiers and people like that, have you ever thought yourself about being a movie star? Yes, but I couldn't make the movies I want to make. We got a million black movies being made in America, and all of them are to belittle black people. Belittle black people? Yes. Yeah. You think I'm wrong? You want to challenge me? I've only seen a couple, I wouldn't know. And which one did you know. see? Can you I remember the name? I saw the Shaft name? movie. Yeah, huh? That yeah. was nothing. And I saw... Uh, Cleopatra Jones, I think. That wasn't was nothing either. No, well, they were just fun movies. Huh? Not just the air, huh? The wise man who makes them know what he's doing. He's lulling black slaves to sleep. Black women on television with their titties out, kissing on each other, and walking around in nude scenes and in the beds with white men. They low rate black people, always cussing, son of a bitch, and so and so and so and so. They show the worst of black society. Superfly, the dope, and the hustlers. Cotton comes to Harlem. Every movie they make is for black people to show them down. Charlton Hester makes good movies. Clint Eastwood makes good movies. I don't make movies because they use black people to keep black people down, and that's the latest trick bank they got, making black people think they're stars, putting them in bad movies. They won't put me in no movies, won't put me in none of them, because if I make a movie, it's it's going to have to be like Ben-Hur. If I make a movie, I'm going to have to be Moses in the Ten Commandment. Huh? That's right, like these faggots. They pick a lot of faggots to play big men. And then they take big men like Jim Brown, our great football player, and put him in movies and make him a faggot. Yeah, uh-uh. I'm too trick. I told you I'm too slick for them tricks. Elijah Muhammad, who's from God, has taught us a trick and a, a, a teaching wiser than that that you have been given us. So when you offer me deals, I look at them. When you say things and read things, I lay back and see why's your motive for doing it. And then I attack you on that because basis, I, but I'm crazy. Because I want to find out about you. That's why I ask you a question. Yeah, They're not know. hostile. You not just want to find out about me. You want to, I do you, find you can find out about me in private. Yeah. You want to find out about me in a way where I can't defend myself in front of the world. No, I want to find out what's oh, different oh, between, yeah. between... Anybody wise, I know what I'm talking about. I'm glad these people are intelligent regardless of who they are and what the color they are. I, they know, they see what you plan, and they know what I'm saying is right after I explained it. Your thing is to get me on this show, ask me something that I can't get, and have me looking like I can't even represent myself and what I believe. I kind of don't know what I believe myself, but you can't do it. A little too wise for you. <clears throat> Well, we'll see. Um, we'll see, right? We'll now, see. Oh, it's another crap. We'll see. No. That means he's going no, no. to get me before we leave the show, no, right? No, 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 Shoot. No, no, no. Shoot. We'll see. That means you're going to get me. It's okay, always, now, it's I'm always. I'm challenging you, mister. 